Hello everyone, welcome to another Python tutorial series. So several viewers have asked how to convert the games on my channel to executables, especially the Yersuna games. So in today's video, I'm going to address this and show how you can do it, and I hope you like it. So there are already some videos on YouTube teaching how to convert Python code to executables, and most of them are, most of them are using a tool called PyInstaller. When I try to use it to convert my Yersuna games, it didn't work, and I'm not sure why, but it's probably because Yersuna is pretty new and PyInstaller hasn't adapted to the new game engine yet. So I did some research and figured out another way to do it. So the tool we're going to be using is a module called CX Freeze, and CX Freeze is a tool to create standalone executables from Python scripts. And that means once an executable is created, you could just run it by itself without having Python installed. Okay, so let's see how this is done. First, we need to install CX Freeze on our computer. So we can search the CMD on our computer and launch the command prompt window. So I'm going to search up CMD and run it. So if you have set up your environment variables for Python on your computer, then you could directly run the command pip install CX Freeze. Since I've already uh, installed it on my computer, it shows the requirement already satisfied. But if you don't have the environment variable set up for Python, however, you need to do some extra steps. So you need to launch Python IDLE. So I will search up Python IDLE. And then you want to go to File, click Open. And in the pop-up window, you want to find Scripts right here, double click. Then you want to copy the path. So I'll just click and control C. Now we can go back to the command prompt, type in CD space, and then paste the path. And if we go into the path, now we can type in pip install CX freeze. And when it's done, you can close the command prompt window. So now that we have CX Freeze installed, we need to create a Python script to do the conversion. So we can create a Python script, which is, in this case, I called it 2exe.py. Or you can call it py2exe.py. And what I'm going to do is import CX Freeze. And from CX Freeze, import star. I want to import sys and then type in sys.argv.append build. So dot append build. So now I want to set up, so I can type set up. This is the name equal to cookie clicker and so this is the executable file name after the conversion I'm going to set options equal to build exe with the packages Yersina and so Yersina is the module that's going to be used and so I'll set my executables equal to executable and this is cookie clicker dot pi cookie clicker dot pi and so this is the python script that is going to be converted and this is the latest game that I created on my channel so I'm going to use this as an example to show how it works so now we can just run the script, and once it's finished, a new folder called build should be created. So if I save and run this, now you see that it is running. And once it's done, hopefully a new folder called build uh, will be created. And then we can double click it to see another folder. And I'll actually just wait for this to finish running. And now it looks like it's done running. So once you run the script, 
once it's finished, a new folder called build should be created. And in this case, I have the folder right here. And if your Python script does not have uh, any assets such as images, sounds, or etc., then it should run perfectly when you double click the exe file, which you could find inside this build folder. So if you double click the build folder and inside you double click this next folder, now you see I have my cookie clicker exe right here. And like I said, if your Python script does not have any assets, then you can just click this. You can click your exe file and it should run perfectly. However, the Python script uh, that I have has assets. So what I need to do is move them into this folder where the exe file is located. So I can go back here. I have my assets right here. So I'll just move them inside this build folder. Let me just click and move them. I can go back into the build folder and I want to move my assets into this next folder. Like that. I want to enter this. And now I see my assets right here as well. So once I have this, now I can just double click the cookie clicker. I can just double click my cookie clicker exe file. And now the game will run just as usual. So once you have your executable files created, it should be easy for you to share the files with others, or also be easy for you to play the game at any time. So this is the end of this video. If you have any comments, please put them below at the comment section. If you have not subscribed to the channel, please hit the subscribe button below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time.